you pass on your reality to everyone around you. And so the way you feel about yourself and others, though you may not speak it or demonstrate it, matters. It really matters. Welcome to Essential Stories, an independent grassroots docuseries and live roundtable discussions that give voice to people on the front lines of our world's most pressing social issues. My call to action is for everybody, especially those in contact with children and young people. Um, Take the time to examine your worldview and where it came from. I'm I'm not trying to encourage or suggest that your worldview is wrong because everybody's worldview has merit because it's your reality. But you pass on your reality to everyone around you. And so the way you feel about yourself and others, though you may not speak it or demonstrate it, matters. It really matters. So take the time to get in touch with yourself and think about what you want to believe about yourself, what you want to believe about the future for the children you know or your own children, the children you teach, and think about how we can just improve ourselves and our society for the sake of each other, not for reaching some sort of checkpoint or goal, but just to make improvements for the sake of each other. I think both men and women, we need to be kinder, kinder to our children, even just to strangers, we need to be kinder. Yelling at someone in the grocery store is not kind. Um, Sexually harassing someone at work is not kind. If everyone was kinder, to everyone in their community and in their lives and even to the people they don't know, I think it would minimize a lot of the problems that go on in our day-to-day lives. I, I want to acknowledge and, and honor everybody's previous words about um, talking to children. And I believe that we the revolution is in the way that we communicate with our children and our community around us. And it is all, that is the revolution. I want to end with a quote from Angela Davis. Um, When you talk about revolution, most people think about violence without realizing that it is the real content of any kind of revolution and revolutionary thrust lies in the principles and the goals that you are striving to, not in the way that you reach them. So we must begin now to behave in the way that we want the world to be. And that's how we teach our children. And that's the revolution that is that we must bring into the world.